your sales team is probably sending a lot of the same emails to your prospects. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to create one-to-one -one email templates inside the Active Campaign Deal CRM for your sales team to use over and over again without typing it all out each time. I'm Jason, growth specialist at Wildmail, where we help make Active Campaign even better for your base businesses. Let's dive in. So before I show you how to create the one-to-one -one email templates, let's talk about what one-to-one -one emails are inside Active Campaign and how they differ from normal campaigns that you might send. So inside Active Campaign, one-to-one -one emails come from a connected email account. So directly from your uh, personalized business email, your personal email, whatever you want to connect to Active Campaign, but it does not come from Active Campaign or Active Campaign email servers. You can use the send a one to one email and automations for certain plans. Uh, if you have the, the specific plan that allows this action to automate personal touch at scale in your sales engagement. So you can send a personalized email, for example, when someone books a call uh, and someone takes a certain action with your brand uh, or reaches a certain lead score. And you can check out this video on lead scoring where we cover this exact scenario uh, in order to nurture these sales opportunities. And uh, basically, add an additional personalized touch point. And then you can also use it manually to send one to one emails from a contact or deal record. Uh, I'll show you in this example here. You have my contact, uh, my example contact here. And I can go down to the bottom here and send a personal email. This is a one to one email. Or I can go into this contact's deals, open up a deal. And then over here in the right, click send an email. And this is going to be a one to one email to this contact. And you can see here, uh, automate sending this email. And you can include an action step in your automations that would allow you to fire off this one to one email uh, whenever you know certain uh, uh, conditions are met in your automation. So those are the ways that we would use these. These are not your broader campaigns that go out to you know, uh, multiple contacts at once or a massive list. And so uh, we want to create templates for these because we're often sending out very similar or the same messages to our prospects, right? Our sales team is sending uh, similar messages when a lead engages with our brand in a certain way. And so we want to go to settings, saved responses, inside Active Campaign. So settings at the bottom here. Open up the navigation menu and go to saved responses. And it says we don't have any saved responses. First, what we want to do is go to manage categories. This is going to allow you to organize your saved responses. Uh, you can do this by team, by team member, however you'd like to do it. Uh, define that internally with your, your team. Manage categories, add a category, and we can just say sales team. Click add. And now we have this, no responses. You can edit it, delete it, et cetera. We'll hit done. In the top right, we're going to add a saved response. This response name is internal. So you can say, for example, books a call or the category, select your specific category that this response belongs in and hit next. And here's where you can set up the subject of the email, customize the message that you want to save. And you can also use personalization tags. So if I hit the percent, so what I did there was the percent sign and it pulls up this list of all of the personalization tags. If you're not sure what these are, you can check out this video here on personalization tags using custom fields to personalize the copy uh, and uh, create dynamic messages. So this will automatically pull in into this template when I select it. It'll pull in first name values, last name values, any other uh, values that we have stored for that contact. So I can create the copy here with first name, for example. We can say something like, hey, first name, and then type out our copy here. Click add. And now we have books a call. It's in the sales team category, has not been sent. And we can use this in our one to one emails. So I'm going to go back to that contact and show you how it works. So I'll go down to send an email. And then in the bottom right here, you'll see what looks like um, a piece of paper, like template. <laughs> Click that, it's the saved responses. And under our sales team category, we have books a call. And now you can see here it pulls in the value for this contact that I'm sending the email to. 
and it would pull in the subject, it'll pull in the copy that you uh, save for this template. And that'll save you a ton of time. If you or your sales team are constantly sending similar emails, but you still wanna have the ability to customize it a little bit before you send it out. Uh, otherwise, you know, automating this, if you have that plan is, is the way to go. Um, but if your sales team sends out a lot of personalized outreach, then you definitely wanna be able to use these saved responses, these templates, tweak them, adjust them slightly, uh, make them personal, and you'll be able to save a lot of time and uh, have a greater volume of outreach for your uh, prospects. So if you have any questions about one-to-one -one emails with ActiveCampaign, just drop them in the comments below. <laughs>